Hello and welcome to a new Vikings episode. My name is Larissa and today I'm going to react to the 19th episode from the last season. Yeah, this is the episode before the finale. So I expect we're going to see some exciting stuff, but I also expect that we're going to see some build up towards the finale and what's going to happen. Or maybe it's just going to be in a really epic two episode finale. You know what I mean? The storylines we're seeing right now are really exciting and I'm especially excited for the Uber storyline because um well they found those um native americans i believe they are and i'm not sure what to expect from that right now also ivor who knows how to win by crippling them i'm also really excited to see how he's planning to do that yeah just a lot of exciting things in my mind right now and i can't believe that after this there's only one episode left and i think i'm going to watch that one tomorrow because i just feel like i can't handle that in one day yeah I just don't want it to end, you know, so I'm kind of postponing it. But anyways, I'm going to watch this episode now and I'm going to react to it. And um, yeah, we'll see where it brings us. They remind me of uh, Westworld. <laughs> the ones in the paint, I mean. I'm really glad it immediately continues with this. Because this is also where it ended and I just wanted to see what the fuck is going to happen. Tovi. Ragna. A word is cook. And so I'm all mine. Take it down. Do they understand each other? Wants us to go with you. No. <laughs> I was already like, okay, that's gonna be a problem, right? How are they supposed to understand this? Glad. <laughs> Abandoned, the king fled. How greatly he will enjoy setting it to five. As we elsewhere. If I had objected, would it have made any difference? Hmm? I really think at this moment she doesn't deserve that because she's been a slave herself and everything and she's just trying to do what's best for her right now but if I was a slave I mean I get them of course everyone just wants their freedom and then you don't care what you have to do I think I'll get him to sleep with me he does it all the time I like that they're getting along so well. If we manage to cripple and injure 500 Saxons, then it will take a thousand more Saxons to come and rescue them. Line two! Advance! I still don't understand what he's doing and how he's gonna do it, but I'm very curious. Some time to make that. 
hard though. <laughs> Holy shit! This is so smart, oh my god. Say about Ivor whatever you want, but he is a fucking mastermind. fire that's so disturbing <laughs> the only one who didn't give a shit was king olaf and then when alfred believes that it cannot get any worse it gets I worse <laughs> i shall take his queen impossible we just walk right up to them and take her Oh shit! You are crazy. You truly are crazy. Oh. Oh, you go, girl. What the fuck? Is he gonna die now? Because that, that was not his hard ride. It was like more in the shoulder. Oh shit. I can't see. I can't see anything. Uh, <laughs> Eric be like. Are they going to do something to Harold now? Feels kind of unfair though, but they talked about it. Are they? I really don't know what's going to happen to Harold, but I kind of feel bad for him, even though I really hate him. <laughs> He's like, guys, where are you? Holy shit! <laughs> Power move! Oh, it's so cool to see him again. So that was the end of King Harold. Down. Why do you want to kill me, Oleg? Who told you to kill me? <laughs> Was it Eric? People are dying. So I guess that 
means she was also sold by him. So now Harold and Eric are both dead. Ah, oh, poor guy. He just wanted to be free. She told her? I mean, she also kind of smiled at her once and I was like, okay, it looks like she's more on her side. That man just wanted to be free. That's really sad. Maybe that's why she also killed um, Eric because Ingrid was like, just kill him. <laughs> He was there. This is our story. Oh. Crazy man. <gasps> Floki. Floki, of course. Said it since the beginning. I really hope we're going to see Floki again, and now it happened. Holy shit! First, I was like, okay, but why, why is there a tree carving of, of Ragnar? Has he been there? I can't imagine that he has been there because they only just discovered this land, and if Ragnar had, they would have known. And then they were like, crazy man, and you already kind of saw from the, the craftsmanship, I think. Uh, because Floki is like the most famous boat builder and then they were like crazy man come down and I and then I just realized that that they had to mean Floki <gasps> This is so nice. Oh my god Floki's back I really can't believe there's only one episode left. What a journey. <sighs> okay, I'm going to be honest I didn't want to record the finale today because the last time I recorded three episodes at once, I was just really tired after that and I really couldn't concentrate anymore. But now I really want to see the finale. The only problem is that my brother will be home in half an hour and then he's gonna make food here and stuff and then I can't probably record here. And if something like really heavy happens, then you just hear my brother. So <laughs> that's not the, the smartest idea. But right now I'm really thinking maybe I can do it tonight or something. I'm so hyped right now. Holy shit. Like I said, I, I really can't believe that there's only one episode left and then this journey is just finished. Yeah, it's un undescribable. Now I can only think about, about the ending. I'm just so happy Floki's back. But so many other uh, exciting things happened in this episode. That fight, that fight was amazing. Okay, first of all, like I said, Ivor is fucking mastermind because literally everything... Uh, he thought of work and just everything he did it was so smart and um yeah i think we're going in the last episode we're going to get like the final battle or something and right now i mean harold died in this one and i honestly at first didn't really understand it because fitzerk and ivor they were talking about okay what if harold dies in battle so when he was walking there alone i really thought okay perhaps someone uh, they ordered someone to kill him after the battle so everyone thinks he died in there But I believe that was actually just a Christian who killed him um, So I'm still not sure if that was like part of their plan or if that like was like a total coincidence But I gotta say I'm glad he's gone And same for Eric. I mean Harold and Eric They're both assholes and yeah, I'm just glad you know We have one more episode left and I hope that episode is just mostly filled with the stories of Ragnar's sons and um, then I don't really need Harold or Eric or, or people like that in, in that episode, you know. Just my personal opinion. I really don't like them and I think most people have that. So what I'm also really hoping to see in the last episode is how it ends with Kattegat. Because let's be real, this story has been going on in Kattegat for 
yeah, since the beginning. And I know there's only one episode left and everyone is in different places now, but I, I really hope that it will end with something like that because it has just been such an important place and I feel like it wouldn't be really finished if we didn't see what uh, happened to Kattegat after everything, you know? I mean, I can't imagine that it will just be left with Ingrid on the throne and be done with it. So yeah, that's something I hope to see. And then the thing with, with Ingrid, that, that man, well, that slave, he was going to kill her, but the other woman already told her um, she had the same mark in her neck. So that means probably that she was also sold by Eric. So maybe Ingrid and her know each other. Uh, and that's why they, they already talked and that's why she, she told it. I mean, I feel kind of bad for that man because he just wanted to be free. And I mean, like I said, if I was a slave, I would also do anything to get my freedom. Because I mean, what, what else is your life worth? You know, not... A lot. <laughs> so I really get him, but you know, that's life. It went wrong and yeah, he got betrayed by some people. So too bad for him. <laughs> and for the rest, I think I've said everything. Yeah, especially the, the battle was really cool. I really loved it. And um, the end, of course. Yeah, I'm really happy with this episode. I'm so excited for the finale. Uh, I, will, I will watch that as soon as possible. If you already want to see the finale, you can check out my Patreon. The link is in the description. And if you like this episode, please leave a like, subscribe, and then I really hope to see you next time. Bye!